Virginia Beach neighborhood wants to know who would shoot a Canada goose with an arrow. It's been seen walking around an apartment complex off Providence Road with an arrow lodged in its back. A warning, the images may be upsetting to you. Ten of your side's Aaron Kelly is here now with the story. Aaron? Labors told me they were in tears last night when they couldn't capture that goose, and now they want to see charges for whoever took aim at the animal. At the Chartwell Apartments in Virginia Beach, the geese have a reputation of being more of a nuisance than neighborly. A couple of days ago, it was like 10 of them in my, uh, right here, just sitting here. Just, you know, like, go away, go away. But on Sunday night, neighbors found themselves sticking up for one they found pierced by a bow and arrow. And I saw her walking and I went, what in the world? And then it dawned on me, she had an arrow stuck in her. A viewer sent 10 on your side these pictures of the wounded waterfowl. Lori Ottenbacher says animal control tried but couldn't capture the bird. It took off, scared. There was probably about 10 of us out here last night. And, you know, we're all upset, we're all crying. Geese hunting season doesn't open till Saturday. Neighbors are still guessing who went after the goose, but some suspect the person with the bow and arrow was just being cruel. I don't know, just maybe show the other geese a message on. I don't know what it was doing, but it's crazy. I think they just don't like them and they just tried to kill it. Monday afternoon, Taylor Weatherington was on the lookout for the goose, hoping to find it and make another attempt at a rescue. I think that should be prosecuted. Or either that or go for therapy because like the, you know, the animal control guy said yesterday, he said that if they start with animals, he said it, it's going to escalate into something else. Now we show the pictures to the Department of Game and Inland Fisheries. They said anyone hunting outside of open season could face a $1,000 fine or six months in jail, up to a year in jail if it's determined to be an animal cruelty case. Aaron Kelly, 10 on your side.